Hi, YouTube. Hi. <laughs> so, I'm Jasmine from More Memories. And if you're following, if you're watching this video, um, hopefully you are subscribed to our channel. Um, I am here to show you guys, ladies, how to make a tool train um, for my flower girl dresses for my wedding. And this is Kayla. And that is Nalia. And these are my god babies. And Kayla, how old are you? Nine. Nalia, how old are you? Six. About to be seven in how many days? Five. <laughs> okay, so here's what we have. Show them the tool. Where's the tool that we're going to use? So my flower girl dresses are going to be um, all white, and I will show them, of course. But we are using purple, teal, and green tool that I have in my hand. And Kayla, can you get that one? Here's the teal one. And I will put the link in the description on where you can get it from. And this is the green one and the purple one. Is here I got them for super cheap online papermate.com for a hundred yards it's it was two dollars and nineteen cents so it was not expensive at all this elastic this is the last piece of the elastic because I've already measured them the elastic I got for I think like four dollars five dollars at Michaels for about I think it was about a yard and I got more than I needed of course so we're gonna show you now Leah's gonna be my example I'm gonna um, tie the elastic on her and in order to close it to I'm gonna sew it sew theirs closed here so then you guys can see the train I, my head is all the way cut off sorry so we have some sample pieces and I'm gonna show you the finished product when they are done so so what we're gonna start with is purple and you take however long you want the tool dress to be and you are going to cut that amount and fold it in half. So this is folded in half already. So fold it in half. This is the length of the train for Nalia and she's gonna get a different height train or length of train because she's shorter than Kayla. So we are going to use Nalia as our sample and I'm going to show you how to put the tool in the elastic and fold it and pull for the tool to stay to the elastic. So with the tool, here's the folded piece. I start from the bottom, go up with the loop, open, put the hanging in like that, and pull. So that's what it looks like. Now I'm gonna take the glue and do the same exact thing. Okay, so take this loop, Put it up, open the loop, put the tool up, pull, okay? And lastly, the green, same exact thing with the green because this is the colors that I'm using for my peacock wedding, peacock themed wedding. Loop it, sorry, Pudge. open put the tool through and pull and this is going to be from this side of her waist to this side of her waist because it's only going to be a train I only want them to have a train okay so here are their flower girl dresses without the train on them and <laughs> these dresses I got for $60 a piece they're plain white dresses so now Leah stand please Kayla turn Okay, and then I'm going to show you the train that we made and then attach it. So this is the finished product. This one is Nalia's and this is a shorter train. So as you can see, this is what it looks like when you're finished. And hers is still open because I have to sew it and show you uh, how we're going to use the ribbon and bow that we got from, well, the sash and the flower that we got with the dresses to incorporate it with the train. Okay, so here's the finished product of what their dresses will look like. This is Nalia. Her train is a little shorter because of her height. So we used the flower that we got and the, you know, this part that we got from the dress boutique with their dresses and just turned it around. And here's Kayla's train so long and beautiful and I think I'm gonna add some yellow ribbon in it just so it can pop a little 
but here are their dresses. They look so pretty. <laughs> and we have to, we're gonna fix this up a little bit. Do you like your dress? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm excited about it. You like your dress? Yeah. yeah. 